Here is one of my few homemade gates. Big, huge, wide gate. This is so tractors can come up here to this top field easily. I'm gonna see if I can get the yos in here. This was a part of the wind charger field. You can see there's a fence running along it. I sewed stuff in here and I set it aside to allow it to have a season on its own. So it's about time that I brought the, uh, I let the yos in here. It's trying to get it to, it's sward to uh, multiply and it has lots of dandelion, there's some nice herbs and d varieties of grasses. There's some beautiful purple clover here. Uh, let's see what else. There's salad brunette there. Um, there's all kinds of things. And look, hardly any thistles. There's one thistle there, some dock there, one thistle there. Otherwise, there's not a huge amount of thistle in here. There's some more yarrow. But it's just giving, I give different fields bits of a break. And this being one, there's a manure heap you can see right there. That's last year's. I'll be spreading that um, next year at some stage. But this is, uh, so you can see they've been, sheep have been grazing and the ponies and the alpaca have been grazing that part of the field. But this, nobody's been on all summer. So I, I've given it a huge long break and I'll put the sheep out here and they will selectively eat what they like. And then the horses will winter here, slowly but surely doing what I've always done, putting a bale, you know, each section will have one, two, three bales. And then I move the fence over and it'll be one, two, three bales. So it's to really manure it, etc. But it's looking really good. It's had a chance to go to seed you can see there's very few grasses with seeds on them left. There's another one here, the seeds are gone. So it'll have plenty of, it's had plenty of recovery time. Now to see if the sheep will come to my call and come up through this gate, which they rarely pass through, down into the field where um, they are down here. Not used to coming this way. Come on, girls! Hey! Come on! Come on! Come on! Atta girls! Come on! On, girls, look, the gate's open. Come on. Come on. No, Inca, don't. Come on, girls. There we go. Good old Becky. Out of girls. There we go. Some long grass grazing. Look, she's eating a seed head and eating another seed head. What are you eating, little bit? Hmm? You're eating some grass. Yum, yum, yum. They'll have a lovely 
lovely time eating a good selection of stuff. Now, you guys are idiots. Inca, come back here. Inca, 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 come back here. Come here. Come on, Inca. Come here. Maya, Inca, come here. Come here. Maya, 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 come on. Come here. Inca, no. You'll stop them coming in. No, no, Maya, Maya, Maya. Okay, there you go. Okay, they're all over there now. Eating. Grazing in the sun. They've all collected underneath the crab apple tree. So they're probably munching down on crab apples. That's a crab apple tree. There's another crab apple tree over there. So they're gonna have a lovely munch of crab apples now. Clever ladies. No flies on them for delicious food varieties. <laughs>